Well, how many times people have said, oh, I don't watch the game, I just watch the commercial. What if we try to create an event around the biggest day for commercials of the year? The Super Bowl. But instead, we had the breaking of the commercial sort of the centerpiece. So, Break the Super Bowl as it stands now is a Super Bowl party like you've seen. We've got pizza, we've got soda, chips, cookies, everything that you expect to see at a Super Bowl party. You have the game being played up on the wall. But the thing that's very different is that we have laptops loaded with all the commercials that they're going to be showing during the Super Bowl. And then the students themselves spend time watching the, the ads in advance and pick which ones they want to re-edit. And then they re-edit them. We review them to make sure that they adhere to fair use, which is using, being able to use copyrighted material in a critical way. And then once that gets approved, we push them up to YouTube so that they are live while the actual commercial is playing during the game. So the idea is that if someone sees that Doritos commercial during the Super Bowl, they'll be like, oh, I got to see that, that commercial again. And they'll go to YouTube, and there will our critique be right at the top. And that's actually gotten us a lot of traffic as a result of it. And we've gotten a lot of really great interaction with people who normally would never even think critically about of commercials. I am the team coordinator here at the McBurney YMCA. And right now, um, our teams are uh, breaking um, a couple commercials. This is our second time um, working with LAMP. Something that uh, LAMP does really, really well um, that, I, that we really, really like um, is that they really kind of talk about um, using like this the digital media platform as a um, as a tool to voice like dissent, um, which is really really rare. But when they get to college in that second tier of education, it's more about critical thinking and picking things apart, and not so much accepting what is like shown to you at first you know first glimpse. I actually found it challenging because um I at one point I got stuck and I didn't know what to think of. So it kind of like it forced me to think further, um, and think more deeply into the about the, the advertisements. Breaking the commercials down it was pretty fun. It taught me like the basics of like editing somewhat, and uh, I enjoyed it. You know, our mission is to help people comprehend media, how to create media, and ultimately how to critique media. And this is all encompassed in this one event. We're looking at actually getting funding to expand it into a series what we're calling Breakathon. So we want to replicate this into what we're calling a toolkit that hopefully we can export out to other cities and other organizations that want to do this.